Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. I'm Stevie Kane, this is Sri. Hi guys. You're watching the Weekend Movie Breakdown, as you're probably already aware, because we've posted so many other videos already, and it's KGF, it's the first one we're doing where we take one movie and we dissect it, and we take it into parts, and we're basically going to be watching the scenes, the trailers, and also the songs, and reacting to them, and post them all for you guys. So um, I'm not going to go on anymore because if you've seen the other ones you know what it's all about. So if you haven't done so make sure you do. This time we're going to be watching Kuk Ge Ratame. Kuk Ge Ratame. And it's KGF Chapter 1 with Yash and well let's just stick with Yash. <laughs> I just, I was just getting really emotional and, you know, just, you could just feel his pain and his emotion, you just, you know, that's, even the music, you know, just that, going, you just listen to it and you're feeling, you're feeling what he's feeling, that's why it felt from the words to the song, um, that you, you're experiencing his emotion and his pain, mm. um, but you know, like you said, from the video itself, it's just more or less his story of who he is and why that even though he's on this journey or whatever, he, whatever anyone might think of him, there's something more underlying inside him. Mm. That's not only his strength, but it's also sort of his weakness as well, because each time he goes back there and that's where he's connected. That's his root. And I think that's what that obviously is the thing that pushes him to help and be there for others. And seeing that, like, you know, obviously he is that, like we said before, saviour, that kind of, what was the word you used? Mm. Yeah, um, Messiah. Messiah. On, and it's, it's like, you, there's so many, like, you know, you think of other things in life, like people need that kind of, just that one person, you know, there's so much to in the lead world. lead the way. Lead the way. There's so much in the world just to come and, come and change everything. Give a belief. Give, give a belief. Like, you know, there's... I can give examples, but I don't want to even mention kind of things that the, the, the kind of pain that's in the world these days that you still have 
in every country, you know, um, they just need that one person to come and give hope and change everything. I mean, even in this time, I mean, obviously saying, we're dealing with the virus much. and stuff like that, everyone's all linked up down and inside. It just takes one person to come up with something that can just lead the way for mm. so many people and help out, really. Yeah, and you never you know, know that one. So, you know, like you said in the last video we did, that he doesn't have to tell his story. You can just feel it through him, the emotions and everything. He doesn't have to go around, you know. And I think many people do that in real life. We always basically oh, try and shout and scream, this is what I've been through, this is who I am, this is my backstory, yeah. this is why. And the thing is, him, he looks like that's my story, it's personal to me. And I'm going to change but things I'm going to, yeah. Whatever I want, I'm but, gonna and, do. And like, like again, like you said, that he keeps he he keeps having those visions of what he's been through, and you could see at a young age he was really angry, at rage in him. You know, he's lost his mom, you know, and the struggles, and that probably she had gone through. Yeah, yeah. To get her pain as well, isn't it? It's that. Yeah, to feed him, to you know, look after him, and then losing her. Who's it? But my father, like you don't know of him don't throughout know. the whole. You know, is there gonna be a father later on? Who knows? Yeah. I don't know what the, I can't. I don't know what goes on if he about the father or something. But can you imagine? I, I mean, there's a chapter two that you find that that person he's got a battle and all that. Mm. He realizes no, that he was his dad or something. Oh, can you imagine if that happens? Yeah. I, I'm just saying, guys. I, I, I'm not sure about. It, but what if in chapter two, they basically he comes across this guy who's probably the guy that probably the main yeah. big bad guy. And then he realised that this was actually his father. Yeah. And now he's got to either stand up for all the yeah. people and the that he's got to stand up for. And, and what his mum said. Or he's got this father that he's got to, like, you know, who's the to total opposite. What she went through, whether it was, like, out of choice That'd or be not. actually quite... Out hmm. of choice or not, that she ended up being pregnant with him. And that was her way of, you know what, you need to put this to an end. Like, put... And might be the other reason why does he want to be so, you know... Like from the trailers that we've seen, that he wants to do, you know, he wants to be so tough. But is it just because his mom said that, or is it because deep down he knows who his father is and he needs to reach him, kind of thing? Because he's that guy who abandoned his mom. I, I, I don't know, I'm just speculating and making stuff up as I go. Yeah. That's why I always my mind starts working on ways that it could films could go, kind of thing. Mm. But it just makes you think of other things that go on as well. Okay, this is about a coal mine. A story about coal mine and what life is like there, and you know you have to say. But but then, like I said, it, to me it starts to make, make me think about there's other things in that there's other things that happen in life, and you know you probably won't be aware of or are aware of, and the surrounding people who are affected by it. I, I just think people tend to judge more with what they see without actually knowing story behind they just like thinking these people are doing this because of that or that's happening because of that mm. or these people have probably got a good life or those people got and mm. you know or yeah. these people are mean because of this but nobody ever wants to understand or know the backstory and not that the other person has to tell you their backstory but it's just that you know empathy and knowing that there's sometimes there's more to it yeah. don't just take your face value and just go in this is good, this is bad, this is right, this is wrong. Sometimes there's so much more to it, mm. you know. Okay. Anyway, that was the video, guys. It was really emotional. I couldn't watch half some of the yeah, stuff in there. I can imagine. Um, anyway, that was the video, guys. Like I said, it's the weekend movie breakdown and it's KGF weekend. So uh, if you haven't seen the other videos, then make sure you do. We've got loads more to come. And uh, like I say always, make sure you click on the like button, share it with everyone you know. And if you haven't done so already, then please do subscribe so we can make some more awesome videos for you. Uh, we need your love, we need your support so we can keep doing this for you guys. And we'll see you on the next one. See you on the next Take one. Take care. Bye. Bye.